Okay, guys, the uh, printed circuit card is in. I've already got it assembled. Uh, you can see there it's a, uh, it's a Express PCB mini board, so it's a standard form factor, and I just put my parts on there. There's really not a whole lot. I've, I've got my, my name and the net course name and the card name and my all that good stuff on there. Um, I made a little power cable for it. And you see there's you draw on the appropriate amount of current, the same amount of current as drawn on the breadboard. Um, over here, you can see the, uh, the signal. Um, here's the uh, carrier, the center frequency of carrier, 8.5 megahertz. See the modulation specifications. It's a deviation of 1.5 megahertz, FM modulated, up ramp, and the update frequency of the, that up ramp is 50 hertz. Um, or the, the rate of that ramp is 50 hertz. Pretty slow, but good enough for the demonstration. The, the corner frequency of the filter is at about 1 kilohertz, so uh, the 50 hertz up ramp gives good results. And here's the demodulated up ramp. Um, so my predictor card is working. Uh, I think the next step is to investigate the generation of this up ramp signal. Um, I've been looking at the uh, Adreno Do and AD 9850 chipset, direct digital synthesis chipset, to see if I can make my own up ramp. So if I've got enough time before the semester's over, I'll, I'll do that too. Uh, thanks for viewing. I uh, hope you hear from me soon. Any questions, you can ask me in class or via email.